Hello, everybody. This is this is Bugsy. This is Bugsy the Curtain. This is Theo. This <coughs> this is Dale. This is Dale Ansaka. This is Dale Ansaka Mario, also known as Mario. Can we all just say one thing? Amy and Sonic don't know what the fuck they're doing. Finally, somebody somebody says it. And it has to be someone that's so irrepressibly handsome. And very, very commanding. Could you could you tell me hey for five minutes? Jesus. I'm just gonna I'm gonna break out the hose on you too if you can't just keep Keep it in your pants. And keep it in both of your pants. I can't help it, man. Me neither. Like, Dale is in, Dale's in his golf girl form. It, it, it's hard for me, man. It's hard for me in any of his forms, really. This is... <clears throat> wow. I'm glad I don't have it that bad, man. But yeah, can we just talk... Can we just talk about Amy and Sonic for a minute? These guys don't know what they're doing. Well, they're gonna confess. What? Well, Rouge is gonna finally confess her feelings to Shadow, and it's gonna be beautiful. And we're all gonna sit there because I'm gonna be like, you know, if we were, if we were, if we were at their office, we'd probably be like on oh, Rouge. We'd probably be helping Rouge a little bit more. <laughs> the fact that, the fact that Rouge said to like said to everybody in the chat like. Sonic ain't never touched a girl. I'm like, how you feel about that, Bugs and Curtain? I mean, I'm a, I'm like a com combination of Sonic and Bugsy Brian. So part of me is just like, both parts are like, what the actual fuck? Like, dude, I'm like, I'm, li I'm listening. Like, I, I heard that. I was like. Dang, Sonic, you ain't, you ain't never, you ain't never, man, that's probably why. You ain't never. Not even a bit, man. He didn't, didn't do nothing. Absolutely nothing. Man, that's just sad. You know, Shadow, you know, Shadow probably, yep. Could you guys not speculate on... Hey, hey, we're not speculating. Dudes, I can hear your thoughts. As, as gross and you two are both perverted. <laughs> so are you. I mean, yeah, but I can hold, I can hold myself. I can wait until I get wait until I get home. I can wait until I get home and give you some... Give me some... Get you some cake from the bakery, if you know what I mean. But I, and the YouTube, nah, 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 nah. It's like, y'all got flooded every five minutes. Can I, can we, neither of us can help it, all right? Yeah, I agree. Because whenever I'm, whenever I see Theo's legs, I'm just, I'm just driven mad, you know? Like a fiend. You know, to anybody else, it's creepy, but to Theo, that's probably like the, like the most sexiest thing you could ever say. It is. I hate I hate both of you. Don't even know why I'm in this video. Because the boss needs you to keep them under wraps while we do this. Oh yeah. I feel like I'm a chaperone. I'm the little brother, and like I'm the chaperone of my big brother. It's fucking. Just yeah. But anyways, getting to the point, I personally feel like, I personally feel like if Bruce is going to say something now, it's now or never. And I'm telling you, I think Lanolin needs some therapy. I know all the people in the Discord, because the boss, because the boss goes there, and so do we. Y'all don't know that we're there, but we're there. I, I gotta be honest, Shadowlin Shadow sounds weird. Because it's not substantial, you know? It's like, Lanolin only loves Shadow for, like, the most superficial things. 
If that's true, I can. <laughs> if that's true, I can hook her up with a metal version of myself. Now let's get the is Mel Bugs even like interested? In, well, kinda. He wants to know what love is. I, uh, Curtain. I don't think we could. I don't think Glanolin would be a good idea for that. Because in your universe, Metal Bugsy is like your shadow and your and your Melisonic. I just think it'd be worse because he looks a li he's like a cross between both and it's just like, I don't know, that's a good idea. Probably not. Yeah, I'm starting to think it isn't. You know, you know, I was, I was, I was walking, I was walking in today, uh, earlier, before we just started to record at night, so I was thinking to myself, like, I saw, I saw them talking about Master Roshi, and then I, then they pulled up Masao, Masato, and we really all need to talk about Masato in the web, on the website. Uh, I gotta be honest with you. Masato basically wanted Shinji to, like, be there, and, you know, I got mean, it's kind of, mm. hey, I'm just saying, if I, I'm just saying, if I'm Shinji in that situation, Bug, Bugsy, I see where those hands, I see you're gonna make that motion with your hands, what, you mean this? Just saying, all that. <laughs> eh. Okay. Okay, now that we got that out of our systems. I think, like, Theo, I understand that for Rouge, she, it's hard for a person to be vulnerable. After everything she's been through, I understand that. I've been through hard shit myself. Like, everybody's like, I, I've seen in the chat, some people are like, for Rouge, but other people in the Discord, they just dogging on her. I'm like, I'm saying, y'all don't know. Some of y'all are just open. I get that. But not everybody is. It's hard for certain people. Why do you think she backed down? She's so... She's so hurting. She's trying to help, but, like... She's trying to say what she needs to say. And Blue, Blue Man is what we're calling this Sonic. And Pink Woman are trying to help. But they don't really understand what they're... What they're supposed to do because they don't get it. Well, you know, those two never been in love before. Oh, they probably been in love, but never could express it still. But here we go. They're not, they don't know what love is, you know. They don't know what love is, you know. Could you two shut up? Can we just finish this? Can we just finish this fucking, can we finish this video before you two start singing fucking that stuff from XL Saga? For, and that's an old reference. You guys are, you guys are old. Hmm, so are you. So are you, dude. Yeah, thanks for doing it in my voice, dude. No problem, I can imitate your voice. And I can also imitate Theo's voice. Oh, Imitate my voice more. Oh, you'd like that. Can you tell just... Ugh. I miss when I was the... I miss when I was the pervy one. And, I, and you and... You and... You and Harima would beat me and... Like, punch my head. I miss that. With you being the pervy one, it just sets our dynamic all off. <laughs> yeah, that drives you crazy, doesn't it? Kinda, yeah. A little bit. <laughs> Anyways. So. Like I was saying. You know, me. You know, me, this guy right here. I believe. I believe that, like, Sonic. Sonic Amy. With all due respect. You guys are totally not qualified for this. I gotta be honest, too. Like. You guys are helping, but none of, but you and Amy are like the worst people for like any kind of romantic advice. 
I mean, you're helping Rouge, but like, y'all can help a serious, y'all can help a serious problem like this. And y'all just basically calling Shadow a jerk and shit, like, but it's other people, but we're like, dude, me and Theo are the worst. Me and Theo are worse. Theo subjugated Toontown. I was a pirate, and you can imagine all the shit I did. Like, I'm talking like an actual fucking, like, seafaring pirate. You know, I mean... Bugsy, don't you dare. What? I'm just showing. Just, just, just hold on. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. The illustrious Captain Crow, the illustrious Captain Crow, and I see someone, someone in this group needs a little cue hauling. Um, um, Bugsy, you, sh you really shouldn't be doing that now. Yeah, I know, but just seeing you blush like that is. Award, reward enough. And to be honest, I was the Phantom Blot, so if y'all don't know, Disney villain with a lot of shit that I've done. Trust me, no one in this, no one except for Bugsy Cartan is a saint. Yeah, man, I hang out with rants. This is Bugsy Brown talking, the one in the corner, left corner. I hang out with Rance, and Rance is a menace. I hang out with him, Bowser, King K. Rule, Taboo. You know, those, me those dudes are my homies. And honestly, yeah, we're all menaces, but we're doing better. That's the thing. Y'all don't understand, like... There are, du there are dudes out there doing, trying to do better, and y'all just, like, want to put people down. But Shadow did this. I'm like, yeah, Shadow did this, but at least he's trying. <laughs> Freaking Sonic and Amy treating him like a red-headed stepchild in the back of a Kmart. What we're saying is that you two are really not qualified for this. Not at all. I think we do a better job. Guess we would. Bugsy, get get your hand off Theo for five minutes. We're still recording. Y'all get y'all can get handsy after we're done. But maybe I I need a little bit of that inky treasure. I swear to God, put your put your fucking hand down, Bugsy. You're gonna shoot it. You're not you're not gonna shoot you're not gonna shoot me. No, but I'll shoot one. No, but I'll shoot one of those bees guns into your hand. I know that fucking hurts. Okay, come. I'll shoot one of those. I'll shoot one of those goo pellets. I know that shit hurts. So, so calm the fuck down. All right, all right, all right. Jesus. But doesn't mean I can't give give her give the a little bit of a squeeze. You have to. Do you have to always do that? Yes, every day. Every day, my love. Every day. <sighs> see, Cartier, see what I got to deal with every day? <laughs> see, but we're, see, but I'm used to it. Like, fucking Amy and, Amy and Sonic ain't used to, ain't used to doing what they do. Well, because you can't magically fix it and be like, oh, I fixed this. I fixed their relationship. Because relationships are a lot harder. <clears throat> Let me just, um, let me, uh, say a few things. Buzzy and Curtain here. Yeah, I have two sets of ears, on X. But, basically, what I'm here to say is this. I feel like you all, like, to Amy and Sonic, to Amy and Sonic of that universe, Rouge has a lot of things going on because he's a lot like the Rouge from my universe. And... It's hard for people like her to open up and y'all just like, well, I don't know what's going on. 
And Amy's like, I don't know what's going on either. You know, because you guys live in happy, you guys live in happy-go-lucky land. I mean, Sonic Guy is like relationship problems. Like the chat keeps pointing out, we need to look at that. By the way, Prime. Oh hell yeah, we need to. I need, I need to know. <laughs> you know what I need to know? I want to need, I want to know why Amy is so compassionate. Like. What's her deal? My love, I don't know her, what her deal is. She just, <laughs> she just said, fuck it, gonna give it, gonna go grab the ice cream, but never go back, gonna let Sonic handle all this. And he barely has a grasp on anything. He re... But at least he's trying. I think, I think, I think Rouge kind of looks down on him because he doesn't try to make a move. I don't think making moves is what this Sonic likes doing. He likes to, he likes to throw an egg man and probably go home and eat a chili dog. You know, I like to throw it evil too, but when I go, when I come home, you know, I'm, <laughs> I'm a little bit about something else. Theo knows, my other wives know. <laughs> See, but that's the difference. I be getting. <laughs> I think we all, we all be getting. Yeah, it's yeah, it's true. That's actually true. But anyways, like Amy, like Amy, Sonic, you guys are doing your best, and maybe that's helping. But next time, maybe not try to help people in their relationship quandaries when y'all don't really have any relationship experience yourselves. We're just being honest here. To saying that Shadow and Rouge's relationship is weird, and yeah, it's, it's only weird to them because it's only weird to them because they ain't never really actually felt anything like that. Tangle Whisper, though, yeah, it's cool in that universe. That they're you know, mm -hmm. they need to bring us to that wedding. I'd love to be there <laughs> just because you want to perform. You want to perform a certain song from Angel Beat, am I right? How did you... You know I know. 7 a.m. and I'm already up. My senses begin to wait you. I'm tying on my scarf. Good morning, I'm gone. Walking to class, I gotta skip a mustache. Something, something, I forget the rest of the words. You open, you know you open my eyes. I know it has to be real. I can't believe you remember that. I can't believe I didn't notice that was you literally, literally hitting on me back in the day. And I just said, oh, you're, you're my friend, Theo. You're my friend. The fuck was wrong with me? Mm, you were dense. You were dense when we were teens. Just wanting to put that out there. But you were cute. <clears throat> Theo, Theo, it ain't about us right now. But, uh, thank you. <laughs> See, now who's, now who's the flustered one? <clears throat> you know what, you know, you know, just, just, you know, the, you know, Maru, could you, could you wrap this up? I, I... I want to go ravish, I want to go ravish my my gender fluid bride right now, like straight up. <sighs> At the end of the day, Roosh, this is a message to all of us, even though these two aren't distracted and, you know, Kurotan's kind of, kind of nodding along because he's kind of with me on this. I got to say one thing. If you do this, you got to you got to you got to understand. Don't take Shadow for granted. Treasure your time with treasure the time with the people you love. Because you never know what can happen down the line, you know? Be there for them. You know? 
I know putting yourself out there is hard. And I don't, we don't know if you're actually getting down with Mario. I, I don't know. But you got, but it's better than just closing yourself off. Wouldn't you agree, Theo? Wouldn't you agree, Theo? Theo? It is. Because by closing myself off, I would never know what really awaited me. And I'm glad that every day I get to spend it with the person I care about the most. Me too. Me too. Babe, you crying? Uh, no. Because I'm kind of crying too. Theo. No. Oh, Bugsy. Can you two just... Yeah, Jesus. Chaotic all father give me strength. <laughs> okay, wrap it up then, man. So then that way we can finish up and we can all go... We can all go home. Personally... Personally, I got... Uh, like, I'm a psychiatrist, Sonic and Amy. And you guys suck at this. Like... In my opinion, you guys suck at this because you guys just don't know. And now Tails' his dad is in this and just, he's like really invested. Kind of like us. A lot like us. But at least we're actually giving actual constructive, criti like actual advice and constructive criticism. Browbeating Rouge, Browbeating Rouge was his plan. <laughs> Anyways. To, to all of you out there, we want to say one thing. We want to say one little thing. Treasure the time with each other. Don't regret a single minute of what you do with your, with your significant other. Cherish them. Always cherish them. And also cherish your friends, too. That, too. And, like, Sonic, Amy, maybe you guys should just hang out with some Shadow and Rouge, you know? So if you ever do go through this again, it doesn't, it doesn't turn into a gigantic shit show. Because you two obviously know what you're doing. Oh, honestly, they must be doing great. And... Gertrude finish it I really think at the end of the day it, it all boils down to the fact that like it all boils down to like both Rouge and, and Blue Man and Pink Woman I'm calling them that because they're, they're you know they acting a little they acting a little wonk they acting a little strange and honestly, yeah, me and y'all just hanging out more would probably help a little bit. Because the whole, like, Shadow's acting like a jerk because da 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 da, -da is kind of, yeah, I get it. You guys want to help. But I feel like y'all want to help for your own little reasons, you know? It's for the benefit of, like, Rouge a little bit, but, like, y'all need to just, I don't know, like, actually, y'all need to actually try. Y'all actually need to try and be tentative. That's the thing. Because you and you and Amy are just awkward at it. Straight up. If the if the four of us were doing this, it'd be a it already would be done. Straight up. Wouldn't take two streams for us to do something. Probably just one. One and then we all go to Goosters and we all start eating Chili fries and turning up the parking lot. Which y'all don't want to see that shit. None of you. None of you want to see that. <laughs> you said I don't want to see that because Bugsy gets a little... Bugsy gets a little freaking just... All crazy. Yeah, we all have to hide the rum from him. Well, I don't need to hide the rum from him anymore. Oh. 
Oh, Theo, that's just ah. I don't need to. I don't need to hear about my bro getting. Oh, I don't need to hear about my bro getting this pirate on. It be. It happens, dude. What the? What the fuck? We're all adults here. Yeah, I don't need to hear you. I don't need to hear you plunge. I don't need to hear you plunge. Tre treasure Cove, my brother. I don't need to hear that shit. Bad enough when we were all in college, I had to hear a lot of things from you, Rance, Bowser, King K. Rule, and, and Taboo. I was like, oh, you guys are gross. Yeah, cramming for, cramming for the SATs for him was hard. I hate, I hate all... I hate all of you from that time, except for Theo, because he wasn't around. Oh, I was, lurking in the shadows of the Phantom Blot. That's what I was doing. I swear to, I swear to God. Anyways, guys, let's just go. Well, I'm, I'm Bugsy Prime. I'm Theo. I'm Bugsy the Curtain, man. And I'm zooming out of here. I'm Maru, and once again, my brother and his... My brother and his gender fluid lover makes me makes me really re makes me really regret being the moderator in this video. God dang it! God dang it! Megalo, please trade with me. Trade with me after this arc, please. I can't handle it. Oh, I'll suck. I'll suck it up. Suck it up, Mar. Come on. It's not that bad. Yes, it is. You two be ogling each other. And, and seriously, do y'all know how many takes we have to do? Because these two, these two right here, him and him, and technically her, because they both change, because, he, because Theo can change his gender. I gotta deal with I gotta deal with both of them. And y'all gotta understand, being the little brother of this man right here is no picnic. Especially with those two constantly flirting. Ah, <sighs> but I'm out of here. I gotta I gotta get home and yeah, probably grab some donuts for stocking. So I'll be so I shall be off. We'll see you guys later. Peace. And remember, treasure the ones you love. Always be there for them. And never take them for granted. Because that is what you will truly regret for the rest of your days. Bye guys. We'll see you soon.